Mitchell Robinson, length, quickness, his awareness isn't there yet, but it's coming. But right now, let's focus on his length and quickness. There he is underneath DeAndre with the little shove off the rebound. Look at where Robinson is in relation to the ball. Most guys wouldn't even attempt for this loose ball, for this 50-50. Mitch is there, though. Mitch attempts, knocks it up. Look at the high point. Deon he makes DeAndre Jordan look like a JV player. That's part of what the kid brings to the table. An uncanny length advantage. Length and quickness. More length and quickness from Mitchell Robinson. There's Mitch right there. His responsibility is the wing, the perimeter three. But he knows he's better used elsewhere. Flash high post. Robinson helps out Vonley. Look at the length this man showcases. It's great. Mitch, pick and roll defense, still quickness, still length, there he is in the lane, DeAndre Jordan sets the pick, Vonley goes over, look at the separation, there's just no chance Mitch could get to this ball, pass or shot, right? Wrong. The man is a beast in terms of length. Next up for the Mitch Robinson experience is rim protecting. It makes such a difference. Look at this. Coming off the curl, he sees the lane. The regular big man gets beat here, but his quickness and speed allows him to keep up with the four and allow Vonley to reject the shot. Here's more Mitch Robinson, rim protector extraordinaire and this one comes from the weak side this one also showcases a little bit of awareness deandre jordan he's on him weak side he doesn't commit too early on the help times it perfectly pick and roll defense here mitch there he is highlighted watch the point guard gets a step on frank frank's out of position a normal five man here would not be able to keep up, but look at Mitch, he's kind of just prowling. He's just sidestepping his way calmly. And look at the space he is away from the basketball, yet still makes it up in a flash. That's just raw physical talent. Though his pick and roll defense isn't quite there yet, awareness wise, his athleticism and length is ridiculously awesome. See right here, that left step, in sticking with the flow and Timmy coming underneath that left step does everything in stopping the pick and roll momentum. More Mitchell Robinson pick and roll defense. Here's a possession against the Mavs, JJ Barea and DeAndre Jordan with Mitch and Frank. Jordan got gets him to the left. Frank goes over the top, fights over the top. Barea has plenty of space and time here, but there's no way he's gonna do anything against Robinson. Too tall, too quick against the shorter Barea. By the time it gets kicked up top, Dotson overplays it, and Mitch has a decision to make as a rim protector. Does he challenge? Does he take the charge? He looks to take the charge early, gets caught in between, which is not a good job, but he's so long and athletic that he makes a contest of a play, and the Knicks are going the other way. When you're five, man, your center is so tall, he alters everything in the lane, it's great. When he's quick too, it could guard pretty much anyone on the floor, that's unbelievable. See the pick and roll defense there, he drops off, stops the kid who wants to go in the lane, and here he goes again, he's challenged by the kid, right here, so many kids would jump. Mitch does not jump, he stays on the floor and it's a great trade of his. 